In the beginning, there was a mushroom. Chapter 1, Orange Mushroom's Secret The orange mushroom is one of the oldest monsters of Maple World, and it is known for a particularly odd habit. The orange mushroom will, at times feel a strong desire to jump for no reason at all. The Black Mushroom Gang who had recently attacked my co-researched Awesome Malicious, spoke about an orange mushroom who jumps for 24 hours straight. Awesome Malicious learned from the interview that if the mushroom didn't jump, then it would turn into a mushroom house. Chapter 2, Axe Stump's Secret Axe stumps are extremely similar to stump monsters, except for the axe in their head. According to the findings of Awesome Malicious, there was once a small girl who had cared for a stump. She disappeared one day, and the stump wounded itself with an axe in the hope that the girl would return for it. It is my belief that the stump in the story is the very first axe stump, and I also believe the longing for the girl was expressed through the axe. Having the axe was thus passed down as a custom of some sort, creating the axe stumps of today. Chapter 3, Horned Tail's Secret Horned Tail has three heads, and each head has its own thoughts and urges. Horned Tail's right head is the smartest, with plenty of academic knowledge. The Horned Tail head in the middle is the most pretentious, and it is the most hunger for power. The one on the left is the most street smart and quick witted. With three diverse heads, Horned Tail is well prepared for almost any situation. Chapter 4 Yeti and Peppy's Secret Yetis are solitary creatures but are sometimes seen with peppies on their heads. Normally, carrying another animal on one's back is a sign of submission. Researcher also malicious discovered that neither is dominant over the other. Yetis and peppies have a symbiotic relationship. The peppy acts as a navigator for the yeti, who has a poor sense of direction. The yeti in turn provides transportation for the short-legged peppy. Chapter 5, Water Thief Monster's Secret The Water Thief Monster was an act of love, innocent but wise. Through multiple trials, also Malicious helped find out that they were stealing to make moisturizers. Although a thief, it was in love with Edelstein's police officer Bell and wanted to gift her moisturizer and be arrested. Love is so complicated that it can make anyone go crazy. Chapter 6, Snail's Secret Snails? Secrets? PFF. Snails are so common in Maple World that no one would ever consider them mysterious. The origin of the Explorer Skill 3 snails was found to be linked to a prospective explorer from the early days. A poor explorer named Shin was envious of his friend Sue for getting throwing stars from his parents. Shin spread the word that even beginners can throw snails and began teaching other per explorers. Thus, the skill three snails was born. Chapter 7, Moon Bunny's Secret Moon Bunny's rice cake is famous for their great taste. The secret behind the rice cake was the ingredients from Maple World. Ingredients from flaming mixed golems and surgeon eyes allowed to produce superb taste. It is astounding that these peculiar ingredients produce such great taste and seems valuable in future research. Chapter 8, Pig and Boar's Secret The ribbon pig's ribbons used to be a mystery but I found out that they are proofs of strength. The red ribbons display that they are stronger than regular pigs and respect that strength. Then those who failed to get stronger and get the ribbon went into Pyrian Mountains to get along with wild boards to live a new life. Because of their strong will to go into the mountains, they adapted very well and grow some tough fangs. Chapter 9, Slime's Secret People have always been curious about slimes and how they might taste. They look like jelly and it's rumored that they are edible. I've commissioned my joint researcher Rosso Malicious to collect slime antenna and cook at them as the following. Ingredients, Slime Antenna, cut them into long pieces. Sugar. Cooking instructions, on low heat, boil down until the sugary taste blends into it. Its taste is similar to apples and perhaps some bread would go well with it. Chapter 10, Pink Bean's Secret. Pink Bean is of another world, 
with adorable looks and powerful powers on the other hand, and he likes music so much he's got headphones on at all times. I commissioned Osso Malicious to use the invisibility potion to approach Pink Bean, but the plan failed. Our next plan is to lure Mini Bean with giant ribs and interrogate. You found out from Mini Bean that Pink Bean is very into Angelic Buster's music and has dreams of becoming an idol.